Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. I don't understand why we had to clear the entire floor. It's because Sable took over building security. Yeah, that elevator goes straight to his penthouse. Pretty sure he's up there right now. There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Ugh. Every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. That should do it. Crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. If I get sick, I'll sue you into the ground. Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember... Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Swear your way out of here. We're in charge. Okay, okay, I'm gone. Five by five. I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. Control, I saw something. Huh? Who's there? Good boy. I got nothing. Resuming patrol. Patrolling sector, status clear. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. Did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire him. Continuing sweep. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic... 
scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. MJ, Sable Presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. What is this thing? Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Hmm, schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. I need to find the code for that keypad. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Self-diagnostic complete. No faults found. Fire doors disengaged. <sighs> Norma could be back any minute. Need to find that Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. Norman locked up Harry's room, wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad. You know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Harry's room, but it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy, at least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed.
Happy birthday, dear. Sorry I'm a little late. It's been a busy month. I miss you, Em. Especially today. I've put Harry... <clears throat> I've sent him away. For treatment. We'll fix him, Em. I promise. Development of GR-27 was too slow to save you. It won't fail, Harry. I'm keeping his room exactly as it is, ready for when he gets back. The key is with you, Em. I know you keep it safe. Wait, Norman sent Harry away for treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. What were you hiding from us, Harry? Emily's terminal diagnosis. I know Harry's mom was sick, but I had no idea it was genetic. Did Harry ever get tested? Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. This is kind of cute. Norman keeps all the campaign buttons from his races. There's one for school board. And he's left room for more. Setting your sights higher, Norman? What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Stay alert. I think we got company.
Public sector, status clear. Super creepy. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. Spiders? Is Norman trying to reverse engineer Peter's abilities? The labels on these cages. Bioelectrokinesis. Optical camouflage. What the hell is he trying to create? scientist thing going on. What are these things? Prototype hand grenades? Harry and Emily's medical records. GR-27 was developed to treat them. Devil's Breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. Osborne, GR-27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's Breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure? I almost can't believe it. Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. Had no idea they owned so much of New York. Commercial buildings. Bravo, bravo, bravo. And this must be the C team. Good old Alpha team. Wow. So many records facilities. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. <sighs> Kinda makes sense though. Michael's is the lead on Devil's Breath. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath lab with this. 
It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Oscorp's going all in on defect. Nope, that's no. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. GR27, that's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that. I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR27, Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. <laughs> Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? We have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Patrolling sector, status clear. Making a sweep. 
need to clear that balcony. You're amazing. It's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You, you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks, partner. to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo, convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. Okay, Norman's on his way to get the anti-serum. Better update Yuri. I hope this is good news. It is. Oscorp just created an anti-serum. There's a cure? Oh, thank God. How quickly can we get it to people? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and Cathedral. Wait. I just got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh no. That could be Norman's helicopter. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry. I'm on it. This'll all be over soon, I promise. 